hey what's up everybody welcome to my channel with a brand new video and today in this video i'm going to show you amd radio and control panel best settings for any pc in 2022 if you want to boost your fps and your pc performance so make sure to guys stick with this video till the end so let's go straight into this video so guys first of all you need to guys follow all of these amd radio and control panel settings so guys let's go and i show you guys how to do the best settings for your amd radio and control panel So guys here after doing all of this AMD radio control panel settings on your PC guys now we are going to do some optimization settings for our Fortnite and do some over AMD radio on GPU optimization so guys for it you need to guys download a boost pack for your AMD radio on guys link of that boost pack into the description so guys open the link from the description down of my this video and that will guys take you here onto my this website so guys here is the download button just simply click here on this download button Sometimes guys it will open the ad so guys simply close out this ad and click here on this download button it will take you guys here onto the google drive so guys simply click here on this download button and download the amd radio on fps boost pack on your pc click start download and guys here we are done and download is, is complete on our pc now guys drag and drop this boost pack on your pc now just simply right click here on your boost pack click here on to extract here button and guys you will get this folder for the amd radio on fps boost pack so guys open this folder here is bunch of files so guys first here is the amd radio and register optimizations second is the storage tweaks third one is the delete game settings file for the fortnite insane performance boost fourth is the fps booster cmd so guys first here is over amd radio and register optimizations folder so guys open this folder here is the guys amd graphic registry query search so guys first of all we are going to install this registry file on our pc and guys you can also read this notepad file what settings guys this registry file do on your PC if you have knowledge about it but guys I 100% recommend you guys to see this safe and you can guys apply it on your PC so guys for installing this registry tweaks on your PC simply guys right click here click on this merge button then press yes and click yes again and click ok 
So guys, after installing this file, if you are getting any kind of problem or if you wanna guys reward your settings back, so you can guys easily reward your old settings back with the default or the stock settings of your Windows. So guys, after installing this registry file on your PC, now go back into the boost pack and second here is the storage tweaks folder into this boost pack. So guys, open this folder. First here is the SDD tweaks and second one is the SSD tweaks. Guys, if you have installed your Fortnite into the SSD, so guys install the SSD tweaks and if you are guys using the HDD so guys you can install the HDD tweaks on your PC guys I'm using the SSD on my PC and I have installed the fort and also in my SSD so guys I recommend you to guys install it according to your PC so guys I have SSD so guys I double click here and this will guys install these files on my PC now guys go back into the main directory of the boost pack next here is the delete the game user settings file of the fortnite Guys, open this folder. Here is the CMD command. Just simply, guys, right click here and make sure to guys run this as administrator. Now, click yes and guys, press any key from your keyboard and guys, this will delete the file of the Fortnite. So, guys, after doing it, now go back into the AMD radio and boost pack. And guys, fourth, here is the FPS booster CMD command. So, guys, open this boost pack first. Here is the FPS booster CMD command. So, guys, right click here and guys, also make sure to run this command as the administrator writes. Then, click yes. And guys, it will take some time to help disabling the power saving features on your USB and the Ethernet. And guys, also it will help you to guys reducing your input delay and also guys fix your ping. And if you are getting the packet loss in your game, so guys, this will fix all of these issues on your PC. So guys, after installing these files on your PC, next guys, here is the remove runtime broker. Guys, this is the application which is running in your background when you play games or using your PC. And guys, this is use a lot of your CPU, your RAM and your GPU. So guys, therefore, I would recommend you to guys also install this file on your PC. So guys, again, right click here on this file, click on the run as administrator, click yes and guys, also install this file on your PC. Guys, after doing it, guys, now go back into the main directory of the boost pack. And you can also, guys, check it out here. Some files credit goes to the Recnotic. So, guys, you can also check it out their channel. He's also, guys, amazing YouTuber, which makes tweaks about the Fortnite. So, guys, after installing this boost pack on your PC, I'm also, guys, give you an extra tip. So, guys, it's time to now go in your directory where you have, guys, installed your Fortnite. So, I've installed it in my C drive on my SSD. So, guys, go there. Now, go for the program files folder. Go for the epic game folder then go into the fortnite fortnite game folder bind ribbon 64 and guys here is the main directory of the fortnite and guys if you are getting the fps drops the low fps the starting issue and if you are getting the high input delay so guys you need to guys make sure to follow my all these steps on your pc so guys here is over 4 exit file of the fortnite so simply guys right click here on the exit file one by one go into the properties go for the compatibility sections and guys follow my these settings check mark here on the disable full screen optimizations then go into the change high dpi settings and also check mark onto the override high dpi scaling behavior and the scaling performed by now click ok apply the settings and click ok again and guys also do the same settings for your all these four files into the fortnite directory so guys after doing all of the settings on your pc now just simply guys one time restart your pc then launch your fortnite and do all of the settings which you want to do in your fortnite then guys enjoy the best performance without any kind of stutter with the more fps so guys i hope so this video really help you to guys boosting your fps and doing the best settings for your amd radium control panel so guys make sure to subscribe turn on the bell notifications so guys till the next video allah hafiz and bye bye